And there's one last thing I'd like to show you is how to configure the speed from the UI on the moving platform. So right here I have a cur the curve speed variable that I created as export. And so if I want to change to 100, it'd be quite a bit faster. And I can show you how I piped that through. So here at that particular uh, top node, we have an exported variable with a set get on curve speed. This curve speed will get called whenever this changes and at the ready. However, because it's called right at the ready, uh, we have to call it, do this as a deferred action because we're not guaranteed the child will actually be set uh, and instantiated before we set the curve speed. So we might get a null pointer exception if we don't do it this way. So uh, that's all we have to do. We just have the lower script here handle it as before. I remove the export from this part because we don't really need it in the sub scene. So we'll just handle it from where we actually draw the curve. So this top level scene, you can draw the dots and configure the speed from one handy spot and not have to know what the children are doing. And so that's the nice thing about software engineering is you can uh, pretty much hide a lot of these details. All right, so let's see what it looks like with a faster speed. Oh yeah, considerably faster. And now we'll show what it looks like with a slower speed. Alright, let's try it out. As you can see, quite a bit slower. So it works. Alright guys, that's all I got for you today. I uh, hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Uh, just like or comment and subscribe to uh, get more tutorials like this. And feel free to ask me any questions. And also, all the code will be included in the